Okay, so we ran out of time in the last recording, but we do have a couple more points to cover. Uh, before I move on, I just want to reiterate the five types of government, monarchy, oligarchy, dictatorship, totalitarian government, and a democracy. Okay, um, one central aspect of social relations would be war, peace, and terrorism. Uh, conflict between and even within nations, think countries like Syria, often becomes ongoing and violent. So this page basically illustrates um, Americans' attitudes towards war. So I'm only, all I'm going to ask of you here is to take a look at the slide and identify an interesting point somewhere here along the lines, um, either the orange line or the blue line, and try to discuss or explain why you think it is where it is on the chart. So look at the dates that are associated with the public opinion and how supportive or unsupportive Americans have been about war um, during these times. Okay, this takes us to our last and final point in Chapter 14, the changing face of the workforce. We've basically discussed this in previous chapters, but since work is so closely related to the government and even more so closely related to the economy, it's worth noting a couple points. And the first one is that the U.S. workforce is constantly changing. So sociologists, they see that the workforce is becoming composed of a more diverse uh, workforce. So you have more women entering the workforce and more racial and ethnic minorities. 54% of new workers expected to be women from 1984 to 2014. And uh, as we noted in chapter 12, 59% of um, women do work now as opposed to uh, very, very low numbers in the 1970s, 40% in 1970. More diverse workforce means relationships between workers more likely to cross gender, racial, and ethnic lines, and that's a concept that interactionists would be highly interested in and looking at um, things like the contact hypothesis and how uh, breakdowns of these stereotypes and, and maybe racist and, and prejudice attitudes um, start to disintegrate because you're able to interact with people who are from different backgrounds from you on a regular and daily basis. So that is going to be it for chapter 14. Please go ahead and go back and look through your notes. Make sure that you've completed everything. As you can see, each, each section is worth points. And I'll look forward to reviewing the chapter and uh, getting feedback from you when we come to class. Thanks. Have a great day.